Hi, Joe Broncato, the Aragon Scientist here. Now, we've had a number of people request a video on a regulator. So, here we are. So, first we're going to tell you what is not a regulator. A lot of people will call a, a valve on a tank a regulator. Even our TJ3 slow flow valve is not a regulator. It's a valve, a simple, I call it a spigot, on, off. Now, sure, a TJ3 is a slow flow. But if you leave this hooked up to your gun while you're filling it, even though it's going to creep up to 3,000 PSI, if you don't shut that valve at 3,000 PSI, it's going to go past that. So you can't tether with it, which means hook it up to the gun, open the valve wide open, leave it, and walk away. For that, you need a regulator. This is a regulator. Now, a regulator does exactly what the word says. It regulates. Okay, High pressure comes in on this side. You set this knob to whatever you want, Low pr lower pressure comes out this side, anywhere from 5,000 down, okay, depending upon what your input pressures are. Now these can be made to fit a number of different tanks. If you wanted it to fit this tank, we would screw this into the input, and that would screw right into the tank and just hang there, and then you could tether. If you have nitrogen, which a lot of guys do, um, this would be screwed in there. We would we would provide that installed in there. That would go to your 6,000 PSI or whatever PSI tank that you have from nitrogen. I prefer another way, and that is I like a male quick disconnect on the input, and I'll show you why. The first thing it does is it gives me a little bit more hose. Okay, You get the 40-inch hose off your tank, your great white. You put your tank on the ground. You put this on the bench. And, well, we'll pressurize it up first. We'll show you what happens. Now, with this backed off and the bleeder shut, we can open up the valve, and absolutely no air comes out of the hose. Now, we're going to hook that hose up to the marauder that we have here, and we're going to fill it. Now, if this was a 6,000 PSI nitrogen tank, we'd have, it, it would be dangerous without a regulator. Okay? So watch tells us the input pressure coming from this tank. This tank was just filled. It's almost 5,000 in there. We're going to start cranking this knob in. Now you see this start to go up. At a certain point, say 2,500 or so, you're, we'll hear a click. That's where the valve on the Marauder will be opening. That's the check valve. So we're going to listen for that. That tells us how much the pressure remaining was in the Marauder and where it needs to be refilled. Let's see if we can hear it. Oh, I heard it. Just went click. There we go. Now we're going to gently turn that up to 3,000. There you go. Now it has 3,000 PSI in it, and it'll stay there with 3,000 PSI. I can fire this gun for 1,000 shots, and that'll continue to say 3,000. So now I have a regulated Marauder. Now, obviously, you can't do this in the field. You're doing this while you're at the bench, okay? But the gist of it is you now can do what's called tether your gun because you have the 80-inch hose here going to your gun, the 40-inch hose going to your tank, or it could be screwed directly into the tank, but you can just shoot all day long. So that's how you use a regulator. That's the difference between a regulator and a valve that we're trying to teach everybody is this is not a regulator. It's a valve. Think of it as a spigot, on, off, okay, albeit TJ3s are slow to flow, but they'll continue to flow until you shut them off. Regulators will stay at 3,000 for as long as you wish until you shut it off. Now, when you're done, you shut the valve off, the valve, the regulator will self-vent, which means watch, you'll hear it puffing air. Oh, see? It's self-venting. Now, it's not bleeding out the gun because it has a one-way check valve. But whatever you have it hooked up to, you can always create the right pressure right there. And there you go. So that's how to use a regulator for tethering or filling your air gun. I hope that was helpful. If you have any other questions on this or other items, give us a call. Send us a text. Send smoke signals. Have a great day. God bless. From Joe, the Air Tank Scientist.